Here's John from Addicted Blaze. I got this SRK the other day. I believe I got it off Amazon. Can't even remember. I've ordered so many knives here in this last month. It's either Amazon. Yes, I believe it was Amazon. It was like thirty or thirty-five dollars or something like that. It's like the budget model of the SRK, but I like it. Come in this uh, box and wrapped in plastic and with the cardboard sheet. Typical Securex sheath. Got a nice uh, belt loop with a Velcro and a snap on it. With a snap uh, retainer for the handle. And the blade's got no noise, no rattle at all. It's a little bit snug. I mean, actually really snug, but it's been getting looser since I've been using it a little bit. I think I cut some bottles and stuff with it yesterday. <clears throat> it's definitely getting looser. And it doesn't seem to be dulling it, drawing it, and putting it back in. Um, come really, really sharp, like the most coast, most coal steels do. Let's take the phone book paper here and just see how sharp it is. Pretty sharp. A little bit of dropping it would be even more scary sharp. But I really like this blade. All blacked out except for the labeling on it. Got the rubberized grip, very secure in the hand. Got a nice little finger guard there, a little, little bit of a little bit of a groove there for your finger, not much at all. This blade is a uh, hollow ground. It's got that black coating on it. I'm not even sure what it is. But it feels really good in my hand and I like the size of this knife. It, I just really like the way it feels and looks and just a badass knife. Let's see what some of the specs are on it. Have to give me a bigger scale so I can weigh these bigger knives. It didn't come with any specs and I didn't look them up. So if you want to know, you can always look them up. Total length is about 11 inches. Blade is about 6 and an eighth. Cutting edge is about 5 and 7 eighths. Handle is about 5 or 4 and 3 quarters. 4 and 5 eighths. got some good weight to it. It's got a lanyard hole with the brass pin in there. Or spine, spine feels pretty sharp. But might have to like file some of that paint off to really get a good spark on a ferro rod. Be great for self-defense or bushcraft or about anything you want it for, I think. It's just great shape and great size. And for the price, they're if you're on sale right now for you can't can't hardly beat it for 30 35 bucks.
So thanks for watching.